everyone, and thank you for joining our first Around the World with All Tour. Uh, we will be bringing these to you periodically to talk to some of the industry's top people. I'm very happy to today uh, have Guy Young, the president of Luxury Gold and Inside Vacations. Guy and I have known each other for quite a few years. Guy is the former president of Uniworld and a senior person with the Travel Corporation. And if you're not familiar with the Travel Corporation, they have Uniworld and Trafalgar and Insight and Luxury Gold. And I could go on for an African travel. I could go on for another half an hour, but this is really to talk about Insight and Luxury Gold today. So Guy, let's get started. I, I wanna to talk to you a little bit about, we might as well get it out of the way first, your COVID policies and what you've seen um, since you started touring again. Great, thanks, Scott. Well, first of all, thank you so much for having me on this uh, on this call. I really appreciate it. It's good to see you, and I hope uh, we'll be able to do this interview uh, in person sometime soon. Uh, great to see you in person at some point. Um, but yes, obviously, um, the good news is that it looks like um, you know COVID is not as intense as it was uh, three or four weeks ago. But that said, we are we do take it very seriously. Uh, and inside vacations and luxury gold, obviously the well-being of our guests is of the utmost importance to us. So as we um, prepared and managed through COVID, we did put a number of policies in place to, to make sure we did the most we possibly could to keep our guests safe, while also enjoying the trips that they're on. So uh, we implemented a number of measures, and I, I guess what I'll quickly take you through is we have obviously our pre-departure, uh, uh, protocols, which is we do require all of our guests to be vaccinated. And if a booster is required, then obviously they'll need to get a booster for the country they're visiting. Um, one of the things we've been very, um, um, very adamant about, and I, I know that you and your advisors are as well, is to make sure that our clients are taking insurance. I think that's very important, traveling in a, in a COVID age. That's important anytime, but especially now. Um, we also made a great tool available on our website. It's a, a tool where guests can actually go and enter their country of origin and the country of destination, and they can then get a listing of all the, the, the requirements for that particular country. And also we try to make uh, uh, our bookings, our trips more flexible in terms of changes and uh, cancellation. So basically we have a no risk deposit. You can put a deposit down if you change your mind within 30 days. We give you a full refund, and then if you do want to change your trip, as long as it's outside of 60 days, you can change your trip at no cost. So we've tried to uh, get our guests as prepared as possible for the trip. And then obviously once on the trip, that's where I guess the rubber meets the road, and it's really the most important. And um, uh, Inside and Luxury Gold, as well as all the Travel Corporation brands, have worked very closely with the WTTC, the World Travel and Tourism Council, as well as the WHO, uh, to make sure we had all the, to develop our entry protocols. But I think um, probably the most important change we made at Inside and Luxury Gold uh, for 2022 is we did add a wellbeing director. So this is a, an entirely different person to the travel director. We still have the travel director, we have the driver. But for 2022, we did add a wellbeing director. And this is for any trip on Inside Vacations where, where we have 21 or more guests. And on luxury goals, it's 15 or more guests. And really the role of the wellbeing director is to make sure that our guests are always following the hygiene protocols. Uh, and then we do make sure we adhere to any uh, of the restrictions requirements in the different countries we visit. So they're really there to help our guests. They can answer any questions if you've had any concerns. They're there to help them with the testing. So importantly, as you know, at the moment, to return back to the US, if you're traveling internationally, you have to take a test within 24 hours and they're there to help facilitate the test. So I think it's a, it's, a great, uh, it's a great addition we made to really give our guests peace of mind. And of course, given we're part of a very really large organization, we've got an incredible uh, operations team and a guest support team that's available 24-7 you know, in-country uh, for our guests. So we've done everything we can to really, um, to really make sure our guests are very well taken care of. Well, thank you, Guy. That, that's great information and, and very good news. And I think our clients uh, appreciate the extra effort you were going through. Guy, tell us tell us more about 22 and 23 for Luxury Gold and Insight Vacations. And I used to call them buses, but I understand I should be saying coaches now. Um, tell us Tell us a little bit about what's going on. 
Yeah, so, um, well, I, is your, your question specific with, with regards to coaches, which is really uh, an important uh, distinguishing point for, for Insight and Luxury Gold. So, because on Insight, we maximize the number of guests we have on tour at 40, and actually Luxury Gold is 24, we have actually customized our coaches to make them more comfortable for our guests. So most coaches on tours that you'll see in Europe accommodate 53 uh, guests. Our coaches accommodate a maximum of 40. So we've retrofitted the coaches, and by having 40 seats as opposed to 53, we've doubled the leg room. So even though, um, uh, you know, it's, so it's a very, I mean, when you're traveling through Europe, you have to get from destination to destination. We make it super comfortable. As I say, it's almost like business class seating. Uh, you've got beautiful views from the coaches. Uh, there's Wi-Fi. You've got individual air conditioning settings. So it's a very comfortable and great way to travel and get around Europe and see Europe at the same time. Tell us the main difference for our guests today about the difference between luxury gold and insight. Both are excellent products. A luxury gold has only been around a few years. Um, we're getting very positive reports on it, which I want to thank you for. But let's let's tell our guests the uh, difference so they understand. No, that's great. I appreciate the the question. So you know, I think that if I could, by starting off to help sort of set the the context for the two brands, is um, I, I think a lot of your guests will be familiar of how uh, cruise lines are categorized. So there's you know you start off from sort of a value brand to contemporary to premium to luxury. And there is the same sort of um, uh, classification within in guarded, guarded uh, touring. And so with Insight and, and Luxury Gold, we've worked really hard to position Insight as a premium brand, and then Luxury Gold is a luxury brand. And the I guess the main difference, there's quite a number of differences now. Obviously, Insight's a wonderful product. It's really a, an incredible premium travel experience. It's really the only tour brand that sits in the premium premium category. There's no other brand that really fits that premium category. Um, but when you talk about the difference between Luxury Gold and Insight, you start off with the group sizes. So Insight will max out at 40 passengers. Uh, you'll probably average around 36, but never more than 40. Luxury Gold has a maximum of 24. So obviously when you start off with fewer guests, there's more personal attention from the travel director, you know, things just run quicker and smoother with, with, fewer num with a fewer number of guests. So that's the first uh, difference. Um, the other thing is obviously hotels are an important component of, of every tour. Uh, the hotels on Luxury Gold are all five-star beautiful properties. Uh, you know, Insights hotels are fantastic. They generally speak in four-star hotels in great central locations. But with Luxury Gold, we do go that extra effort and we make sure that, um, you know, we're staying at five-star properties. Uh, there are a couple other things. In terms of the experiences, so Insight uh, will, for example, give you priority access at museums and sites. Uh, but with Luxury Gold, we have true VIP experiences. And these will be experiences where you go after hours, uh, just with a small private group to places such as the Chandra Palace, uh, the Hermitage Museum, uh, and a number of different other locations, where it's just our group after hours for a really exclusive VIP experience. Um, we also have what we call uh, choice of excursions. Uh, so when you are taking a luxury gold trip, um, you have the option to do, to, to do a diff uh, two different types of excursions on 50% of the touring days. Um, so uh, a great example I like to use if you're in uh, South Africa on our South Africa trip in Cape Town, uh, I happen to be from South Africa, which is part of the reason why I'm using that as an example. Uh, but we take you to uh, to the vineyards, uh, Stellenbosch in Cape Town, which is it's a, it's a beautiful area, just amazing. And on that day, you have the choice of either doing wine tasting or actually cycling through the vineyards on a bicycle. So that's your choice that you have. So if you're a bit more active, you can choose to do that. The one thing you can't do, you can't do wine tasting, then, then do bicycling because that could be quite dangerous. So you have to do one or the other. So you have choice of, uh, of excursions, and that again, that's on 50% of the touring days. And then just, you know, the, the, the food experience on, on Inside is wonderful, but, you know, Luxury Gold, we, we elevate it a bit more. There's, there's private cooking classes. Uh, we also do street food, you know, because street food's a great, uh, a great important part of the culinary experience. 
but we also have mission star restaurants so on every single departure there'll be a, a mission star dining or something that's equivalent to mission star dining so we really have sort of elevated the dining uh, over uh, over uh, inside and frankly in my opinion all the tour operators out there and then just sort of as a one other uh, point of reference is on luxury gold our transfer service is a private car from your home to the airport and then we return you've got a private transfer from the airport back home so it really is truly a five-star experience oh and, and i think the other thing i hear very positive things about your tour directors I think they've been with you an average. I, maybe you can tell us how long most of your tour directors have been you with with both of your products. Yes, yeah, so uh, you, uh, it's a it's a good question because often what really um, what really makes a tour is a tour director, or in the case of Luxury Gold, we refer them to them as traveling concierges. So yes, we 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 take an enormous amount of pride in our in our travel directors, and. Um, we first of all in order to work for either one of our brands they have to have at least five years experience but i think what's most important uh with inside and luxury gold is we have uh, a professional development program and we have a full-time uh, trainer she actually came from virgin atlantic so she's a very experienced a great trainer um, and she puts all of our travel directors through this uh, professional development and we have a refresher course every year before the start of the season so we do have really, truly wonderful travel directors and we have travel directors that have been with us for, you know, for 30 years. Uh, so we are known to be a, a great company to work for. Uh, we really do take care of us, all of our staff members, but obviously the travel directors are really key to making a successful trip. So we're very proud uh, of our travel directors. Well, I think the last question, which I think is very important, tell us a little bit about 22 and 23 and do you have any new destinations that uh, you think our guests would be interested in? Great, thanks, Scott. So, um, you know, I'd say that 2022, um, a lot of our focus in terms of new product development and new destinations has been around domestic travel, because obviously during the pandemic, that's been our most popular itineraries. And so, one of the um, one of our great new itineraries we launched is with Inside Vacations. We've got a a trip to Hawaii. We've got two itineraries. One's a seven-hour itinerary, one's a ten-hour itinerary, and that's been very, very successful. Uh, something else that we've launched uh, for 2022 on Inside Vacations is what we're calling limited edition small group journeys. Now, these are, are, are trips, uh, again, domestic trips, either to national parks or northern or southern California, where we have a maximum of 17 guests. And these trips are designed to get our guests into um, locations and experiences that you wouldn't be able to do with a larger group. Uh, and we've also been able to access, you know, smaller boutique hotels. So it really is fantastic. They, they, they are, and, and we actually run these trips on small uh, Sprinter Mercedes vans. So they're, they're truly, you know, great transportation. They're brand new. Uh, they were purchased for, for Inside and Luxury Gold. Uh, and so we launched that about a month ago, and that's proving to be very, very popular. So those are some of the um, the new itineraries for and the new products for 2022. Um, you know, in terms of what we see selling is, again, as I mentioned to you before, domestic travel has been very, very strong in 2021 and 2022. Uh, in fact, our 2022 sales on domestic travels ahead of 2019. Um, and national parks are very popular. Alaska has been very popular. So that's done very well for us. And then looking to Europe, which as you know, Scott is our most important uh, destination, you know, the perennial favorites are, are doing well. So Italy's still our number one destination. That's doing very, very well. Uh, Spain, uh, the UK and Ireland also doing extremely well. And their growth in 2022 is probably the best out of all of our sort of larger uh, international markets. We, we're doing very well in Portugal. We're doing very well in Iceland, but those are smaller, uh, smaller destinations for us. So, but our big destinations are, are all, you know, recovering quite well. But I'd say at the moment, the UK and Ireland seem to be two standouts for us. Well, that's terrific. Well, Guy, I thank you for being our first interview on our new program. Uh, I appreciate it, and I hope to be back in New York and see you soon. So, Guy, Guy Young, President of Insight. And Luxury Gold, I want to thank you again. You take care and we'll talk soon. Great. Thank you, Scott. And thank you to you and all your great advisors. And I hope to welcome 
many of your guests in the future on Inside and Luxury Gold. And thank you so much for your time and, and the opportunity to speak to you and your, uh, and your guests and your advisors. Thank you, Guy. Thanks. Bye.